Hey guys. So it feels like it's been a while since I've talked to you guys. It's been about three weeks or so. It's just really strange not having that weekly Lasties vlog on Fridays. I thought that I would have kind of the routine down by now. I really liked having the structure there to sort of force myself to vlog every week. Now that that's not there anymore, we have our new format, then I don't really have an urge to vlog every week, and that kind of sucks, because I really liked having the record of every week. I'd like to continue doing that, but it's really hard to motivate myself. It was a lot easier to have you guys motivating me sort of in the background, like always thinking, oh, I have to make a vlog. Anyway, I guess the break from vlogging actually came at a pretty good time because this quarter has just been really, really busy for me. I'm teaching again this quarter and I always forget how much work teaching is. This is the fourth time I'm teaching this class that I co-created with my advisor. You'd think that it'd get easier by now, but it's still a lot of work. It's still so much energy every single day. On the days that I'm not teaching, I'm preparing or I'm making sure that they have all the materials that they need. And then on the days that I am teaching, well, then that's just lecturing and office hours and just everything is just so much work. The interesting thing is that even though it's extremely exhausting and time consuming, I really do enjoy it. I enjoy answering student emails when they have questions. I don't mind staying late during office hours if there are a lot of people. I'm willing to do the extra work to prepare for lectures and make sure that everything runs smoothly and go to class early to set up everything. I'm totally willing and I love doing all that extra work. But at the same time, I'm really not that into my own research. I drag my feet on finishing certain tasks. I'd rather go home and rest than stay late in the office to do my own work. I'll put things off until the next day or the next week. It's actually really analogous to my vlogging issue. When I teach, I don't do it for myself. I do it for the students. I want them to learn. I want to do a good job doing that. I'm not trying to show off how much I know or think that I'm better than anyone. I'm not doing it for recognition or fame or fortune because clearly teachers don't get any of that. My point is that I'm willing to go the extra mile when I teach because my motivation comes from the students and not from myself. And the same thing was true with my collab channel. My motivation was to make a video for you guys. It wasn't just to make a video for myself. Anyway, I was not actually planning on finding a parallel between vlogging and teaching, but there it is. It was just something that I noticed as I was making this. Anyway, as busy as I've been the last three weeks, I'm taking a break this weekend because I'm going to Lake Tahoe to ski. This is the same school-sponsored trip that I went to for the last two years, so I'll be doing another lesson and staying in those fancy cabins. And this time, I'm bringing Sam, so it should be even better. He said he'd be my videographer, so hopefully I'll come back with some clips of me skiing, or trying to ski, or falling a lot. Anyway, that's it for now. I hope you guys are all doing super well, and I'll see you guys next time. You're amazing, you're wonderful, and you are loved. Bye. I hope you liked Maggie's video. He makes the best kind of videos. You're amazing, wonderful, and you are loved. So I hope you liked Maggie's video. That's Maggie's video.